a man came to the Prophet Sallallahu and he asked him, he said, look, we're travelers on the sea. And when we travel on the sea, so in other words, sailor, when we travel on the sea, uh, we take some water with us. And if we perform wudu with that water, then we might die of thirst because sometimes you're out in the sea for hours or days and you only have a limited supply of fresh water. So if we perform wudu with that water, then you know we'll, we'll die of thirst. What should we do? Can we perform wudu with sea water? So here there's a few things that we need to understand. Why is this man asking this question for? Why is he asking this question? That's the first thing we need to understand. Number two is um, what's, what's the ruling of praying at sea? Number three is are we allowed to work travel by sea? So, okay, I'll ask, I'll ask you this. From this hadith, what's the ruling of uh, traveling by sea? Would it be allowed? Yes, it would be allowed. Why would it be allowed? Because the Prophet Sallallahu he approved of it. Yeah, because the rest of the hadith says this. The Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, the water of the ocean is definitely a purifier and its dead are lawful. So from this we understand that implicitly, implicitly that we are allowed to travel by sea. Because the Prophet ﷺ would not allow someone to do something if it was wrong. Uh, 